Hello and welcome to Work Tools 123. Today we're going to talk about a couple of uh, overlooked iCloud apps, uh, which are great for Apple users. Notes uh, are really a great way to write notes on meetings and important topics um, and keep track of uh, important themes and ideas and talking points and keep them all in sync across all your different devices. So Notes is right here. It's sort of that notepad looking thing. And uh, the Reminders app is these little multicolored circles. So let's jump in. Um, jumping into Notes. You can see it gives you a list of all your existing notes. If you want a new one, you just click the word new, upper right hand corner, and it creates uh, a new note for you. We can call this one um, notes test one. And if I'm done and I go back, you can see there it is at the top of the list. If you wanted to go in and create reminders, go into the little uh, icon there with the multicolored circles. Um, this is an existing one I have for work. I can go back to all of my different reminder lists by just clicking on the title. And then if I want to create a new one, I can say new list. I want to sync it to iCloud. Um, and then go in and say test one. I'm done. I go back. There it is with my other items there. Um, the great thing about it is you can put in different items and you'll see in a little bit that I can check them off across different devices. So as I move from one device to another, I can check them off and it'll be synced to all the different devices. The next thing I'm going to do is come back and show you how that can uh, display across uh, different devices, your iPad, your MacBook, even a Windows machine via a browser. And then you can make changes in all those different devices and it's going to sync to all of them, uh, which is a really, really useful way to uh, uh, stay on top of notes and to-do lists. So now we want to show how you can go in um, on your iPad and see the synced up notes and reminders. So again, I just click the notes uh, icon. I go in, there's the notes test one that I created on my iPhone. Uh, it's right in there. I can go in now and I can um, edit it if I like. So just like with the iPad, you can go into your MacBook and you can uh, select the applications and go and find your uh, notes. Okay, so you can go in, you can see your whole list of notes and there's the notes test one, right? And you can also go in and find your uh, reminders app on your MacBook. And that's going to fire up and you can see it has the various uh, to-do lists and there's the test that we created, right? Um, and if I wanted to check off this item, I could just check it off, right? That's going to go away to complete it. If I want to show those, you might recall I checked off item one um, on the iPad. There's the completed task or I can hide those and that's going to sync across all the various devices. Okay, the last thing I'm going to show you is how you can access uh, notes and reminders via any web browser, which is very helpful if uh, you're like me and you have to work with a Windows machine at work, um, and uh, so you can get in and check all this stuff. It's also great if uh, you get a dead battery with your Apple devices or you're just traveling, you're at a friend's house or a family member, and you just uh, have to get there via browser. So what you do is just go to iCloud.com and log in with your iCloud username and password. You got your notes and your reminders right there. Um, you can click in and you can see that uh, there's that notes uh, test that we did. Go back to the home screen, go to reminders. You can see, you know, here's the uh, to-do list we did with a couple of completed items. And you can do all the same things through the browser that you can do on your Apple devices. You can create, update, and delete notes and reminders, and it's going to sync across all your different devices. So that's it for today. Thanks for visiting WorkTools123.